Within a few short years, the hostility between Swiss Protestants and Catholics will explode into a full-fledged civil war that will ultimately culminate in Zwingli's death. Zwingli has no way, of course, of knowing what the future holds. Yet it's becoming increasingly clear that the Reformation is setting off a domino chain of conflict. It begins at the Diet of Speyer in 1529, when the Emperor rescinds the Edict of Toleration. At this meeting, it was decided that the Reformation, which had been allowed to go on in a number of provinces within the Holy Roman Empire, would no longer be tolerated. And the princes who had, who had allowed the Reformation to go on within their territories issued a protest against that legislation. That protest gives birth to the new name of the Reformers, Protestants. The Reformation is taking form, with Protestants on one side and Catholics on the other.